Today I will explain why choosing the new AEZ-303 stainless steel nozzles is the most advantageous choice, also in economic terms, instead of the classical brass model. To fully understand these matters, it's necessary to quickly introduce the galvanic corrosion. Galvanic corrosion occurs when two different metals, one noble and the other less noble, are immersed in the water. In this case we use a stainless steel tube and we screw a brass nozzles. When the water passes through the tube occurs the phenomenon of galvanic corrosion of the brass nozzle street. To avoid this problem normally it's used a stainless steel adapter, so it's the same material of the tube that isolated the brass nozzles. This is the classic system to use the brass nozzles on a stainless steel tube. Hydrobase Group Innovation is a nozzle which is made up of three components. The body, which acts as an adapter, should be mounted with the help of the drop of sealant directly on the steel pipe. After waiting an hour, the sealant shows its effect. Now it's possible to assemble the interior that is composed by a rubber ball, a spring and a small piston that breaks the water. This is the difference. The traditional system consists of an AEZ-304 stainless steel adapter and the nozzles made of brass. The new Hydrobase Group solution consists of an AESIS 303 stainless steel nozzle. We all know that is the difference in quality between a brass nozzle and a steel one. The steel is a more noble metal that provides greater longevity. In this case we have a higher quality and at the same time price of a brass nozzle. This is because we are not going to use the adapter, since we have the nozzle body itself that works as an adapter.